Mark, as of right now, nothing has changed here in Nebraska. Abortion is still legal. Of course, many are concerned that will change in the near future, but doctors and advocates urge people to continue seeking care in the meantime. A moment of sadness and then a big sleeve roll up. The work of some doctors and advocates to fight against an abortion ban in Nebraska started long ago and continues following the Supreme Court's decision. But they say nothing has changed yet. Abortion and other care that may be affected by a ban is still legal in the state. Nothing's changed, which I think is really important at this very moment for people because I think a lot of people are pretty um, concerned appropriately. Doctors say everyone should be informed of the possible outcomes, but urge people to continue seeking care. I hesitate to have people living in fear. I don't want people to be, um, you know, afraid to get pregnant, afraid to, to live their lives and things like that. I think that this is a scary time. In the interim, our recommendation is that patients continue seeking fertility care um, and that you know, they continue to advocate on their behalf as well. But they are getting prepared. In light of the Supreme Court's decision, organizations that serve women, like the Women's Center for Advancement, are working to ensure resources for their clients should Nebraska ban abortion. Educating ourselves on, on the healthcare aspect of it and then um, finding financial resources that may help our clients to access those new resources. And they'll keep fighting both for those they care for and for each other. The Nebraska legislature is expected to call a special session this summer. Governor Ricketts has said he does not support abortion even in cases of rape or incest. Reporting live in the studio, Alyssa Curtis, 3 News Now.